Hey, this chair, we're going to watch our writings and videos. Why don't take a while to relax? Let's go. Did you see any of your favorite brands? If so, how about this? IT, LV, G2000, ADNF, or the uniform of the City University, Hollister. Brand name for the Pursuer are so common among Hong Kong teens nowadays. And now, I'm gonna tell you about how to solve this problem. Some say that this problem is mainly caused by the parents who always give their kids money. So the most effective way should be cutting their income. However, do you think that it's really workable for those earlier teens? No, they can earn money by themselves or even get a brand name product in some illegal ways like stealing and compensate dating. It's even worse than pursuing famous band. At this time, some would say that if the hard way is failed, then just use the soft way. And what the most common soft way is education. Yeah, education again and again. We cannot say that education is useless, but it will lead to take a long term education and keep telling the teens that you should have a properly value. Appearance is not all of your life, and blah blah blah. Yes, I know, I get it. In the exam, I'm sure that I will write those model answers on the papers. Before my life, sorry, these theories are not my cup of tea. Because. When I was seven, most of my friends stopped believing in magic. That's when I first started. They were beautiful. They were happy. They didn't even need any money. They had magic cards. Rebecca Bloomwood. Dress, Zach Posen. Belt, Todd Oldham Vintage. Bag, Gucci. Yes, they the reality. So what I want to say is, education is important, that's true. But first of all, let's think about that. Why the teens pursuing famous brands? It's because they believe that it's a fashion icon. Here, I want to take two famous fashion icons of Hong Kong as example. They are Sean Yu and Edison Chen. They start to be artists at the same period, and both of them become fashion icons soon. The most different is Edison is come from a rich family, and all his clothes are brand name products. But son, who come from a Yunnan estate, didn't wear brand name products at all. So, what we should do is teaching the teens how to be a fashion icon without spending much money, but not the boring old school education. Maybe some of you think that it's unrealistic. But I'm sure that the teens would love it. And one last point. It would be great if the government can put more sources in fashion design field. I believe that it would be a strong power for the local designer to produce more local products and more high quality local brands can be found. It would be good news for the fashion followers since much more choices will be provided. They can easier to find the clothes which match their styles, and since there are more supplies, the products will be sold in a lower price. It's not only the good news for the Hong Kong teens, but also the Hong Kong fashion world. So, let's be a smart fashion follower who not just pursue famous brands,
See you.